the DC Open Day took place this weekend, which allowed Leaving Cert students to get a feel of the campus and give them the chance to meet with college ambassadors to help them with any queries. So this year we decided to go to the Helix, we normally do it in the venue and in the old bar, but we decided to go to the Helix this year, just to give a little bit more of an atmosphere, I suppose, of an occasion and uh, an environment for the students uh, to see and also the parents. It's uh, been very popular so far this year, the weather has also helped, uh, which also kind of plays as part to it was rain and it, it doesn't uh, be as good. But the Helix is the main attraction this year, we moved it all to the Helix and I have to say it, worked, it wor has been working out a lot better. Um, I've enjoyed the open day so far, like it was worth coming to see. I'm only in fifth year, so I'll probably come back next year for another look around but talking to some of the students gives you a better insight into what it'll be like so it's interesting. Uh, I like the idea how um, you're involved, heavily involved with like other countries so like universities so especially with business courses. Uh, just a general feel for the college and get a bit of information from the courses I want to do and you know, uh, they, they helped me compare different business courses in different universities so they said this one they really inspired me to put down this course for business here. So. The ambassadors also gave insight into what a student will hear when they attend the talk and also the difficulties faced when trying to give campus tours. Uh, so when a student goes into a talk, they'll, uh, the talk will usually be led by the course chair. So they'll tell you a little bit about the course, um, the points and um, what you'll learn on the course. They'll tell, you, they'll tell you your options as well, so if you're doing international business, uh, the languages that you can do, the options that there are in global business because we have five different courses. It's kind of hard to show them around on tours with the fact that there's so much construction going on and it looks a bit chaotic but, uh, but overall it's, it's kind of it's very busy, thriving and uh, yeah, it seems good atmosphere around the place. Liam Ashton, DCU TV News.